Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me the S Pen 4 Samsung Galaxy Tab S9 Plus and in this video I am going to talk about top 18 tips and tricks about this S Pen. So let's start. The first feature is about taking notes on top of videos. For example, I will attach my S Pen for charging and now I am having a lecture or I am watching some kind of video and I want to take notes about this video. So I will remove my S Pen from the backside and it will directly open the notes and here I can start taking my notes. But here you can see this note taking app is blocking the view behind. So what you can do is just select this blue bar then select this opacity icon and then you can reduce the opacity now you can see the video behind and you can also take your notes the next thing is if you want to do the screen recording of your note taking and your video you can also do it just bring down this quick panel then select this screen recorder option and then you can start recording so after this countdown your screen recording will start now if you want you can use this pen option from the screen recorder and you can highlight anything important in your video the next thing is you can also turn on the front camera so here is the front camera option just select it so now my front camera is open you can see it here now whatever you do on your screen it will record so once you finish you can just select this stop option your recording will save in your gallery and then later you can access it and you can share it the next thing is getting any object from a video and insert it into your notes. So I will just swipe from the corner and open this video in a pop-up view. Now I will open uh, my notes and here I can start taking my notes. Now for example I want this object from this video. So what I will do I will use my S Pen. I will press and hold it like this and here you can see I select this object and then I can insert it into my notes directly and then if if I want I can also change its size I can also crop it I can do all the editing the next feature is about creating fast access to QR codes or any other important information for example I open this ticket and I want this QR code pinned on my screen so I will open this air command option and then I will open this smart select tool then I will use my S Pen and I will select this QR code so here you can see the QR code is now selected then you just have to select this pin option so I will just select it now the QR code is pinned on my screen and if I open any other app the QR code is still available now you can see this QR code is taking a lot of space on my screen so you will just tap on this QR code and then here you see this option of minimize just select it once you select it here you can see the QR code will be minimized and it will be Become like a small thumbnail and if you want to access it just press it like this and it will become bigger and you can access it the next feature is about adding text to your notes for example I open this website and I want this text into my notes so I will use my S Pen I will press and hold it like this and I will select till here now once you select it here you see different options available so just select this add to note option so once you select it it will add this text into your notes now you can change its size so I will make it full size so here on my notes the text is now available and on top you will also get the link for the website from where you get this text if you want to remove it just press and hold it like this and then you can delete it now you can edit this text you can highlight it and you can share it the next feature is about using your s pen to unlock the tablet for example i will lock my tablet now i will just press and hold my s pen button like this and it will unlock the tablet for me and it will also bypass the security if you want to disable these settings you can just go into the s pen settings and you can disable it the next feature is about taking a screenshot and sharing important information with your 
S Pen. For example, I open this website and I want to take a screenshot. Now what I will do on my S Pen button, I will just press and hold it like this and I will do a zigzag gesture in the air like this. So it will take the screenshot for me. Now here if you want to highlight some important information, you can use your S Pen to highlight something important. If you want to write something, you can also write and then once you finish, you can just select this share icon from here and it will show you all the platforms where you can share your screenshot. The next feature is about using your S Pen as a remote control for taking pictures. So I will just press and hold this S Pen button like this and it will turn on the camera. Now I want to switch it to the front camera. So I will again press this S Pen button and I will do the air gesture like this and it will turn on the front camera. Now if I want to take the picture again, I will press this S Pen button and it will take the picture for me. So once you finish with taking picture, you can also write on it. Just select this pen icon from here, then uh, select this emoji icon and here you can start writing. And once you finish, you can just save it and you can share it. The next thing is if I go back from here, then if you want to switch to the video mode. So again, use this S Pen button and do the air gesture like this. And here you can see it will turn on the video mode. Now, if you want to start recording, again, press this S Pen button like this and here it will start recording. And once you finish, you can again press this S Pen button. It will stop the recording. The next feature is about S Pen to text. For example, I want to search something on Google. I will use my S Pen. I will just select it like this and then I will start writing. For example, I want to search something about brain anatomy. So I will write it like this and it will convert it into the text and then here I select this Google search and here it will show me the results. Same way I can also use my S Pen if I want to open a website. So I will just select this URL section and here I will write the name of website with my S Pen and then it will convert it into the text and then I select this go option and then it will open the website for me. The next feature is about dragging image or text into your notes. So I will open my Samsung notes and here I will start taking notes. Now I want some image from Google into my notes. I will just take out this edge panel. I will open the internet browser in the split screen. Now here I search some images on Google. For example, I like this image and I want this image into my notes. I will use my S Pen. I will press and hold it like this and I can easily drag here into my notes and then if I want I can also make it bigger I can rotate it I can crop it as well same way I can also bring any text into my notes so I will just go back from here I will open a website for example I open this website and now I want this text into my notes again I will use my S Pen I will select this text and I will select till here. So now I will press and hold it like this and I can easily drag it here into my notes. The next feature is about glass mode. For example, I open this website and I want this website in a glass mode. So I will open the air command and then I select this glass option from here. So once you select it, you can see the website become available here in very small thumbnail. Now I will bring my pen closer to it. I will just hold over it like this and it will open the website and once I remove my pen it will again go back to the glance mode. Now I can open any other app for example I want to open Samsung notes and here I want to take notes and I want to get some information from the website I will bring my pen closer and it will open the website for me and once I remove it and then again I can start working on my notes. So you can use it for cross referencing or if you want to switch between different apps you can also use glass mode. The next feature is about extracting a text from image. For example, I open uh, my gallery and here I have uh, this image. Now you can see there is some text. I will use my S Pen. I will press and hold it like this on this text and now I can start selecting it. So here you can see I select all of this text. Now if you want, you can share it 
okay so if you just select this share option so here are different platforms you can share it in your notes as well for example i select the samsung notes add to new note and here is all the text available in my notes and later if i want i can edit it i can highlight it the next feature is about using your s pen for translation for example i open this website and here you can see it's a different language now i want to translate it so i will just open the air command option and then i select this translate so once you select it what you have to do just bring your pen closer to the text so I will bring it closer to the text like this and here you can see it is showing me the translation now for example if I want to translate this line so I will bring my pen closer and here you can see it is showing the translation that it is a smartphone the next feature is about screen of memo for example your tablet is locked and now you are in a hurry and you want to write something important just use your S Pen button and tap on the screen two times like this then it will open the screen of memo and here you can start writing you can write anything important that you want and here we have different colors option so you can change the colors as well so once you finish you can just save it and you can access it from your Samsung notes the next feature is about writing on videos for example I will open this video and now I want to write on this video so I just select these three dots then I select this editor and then I select this emoji icon and then here if you want you can select this live option and now you can start writing if you want if you want to change the pen you can change the pen from here for example I want to change the color I want to change the thickness and if you want to highlight something you can also do it once you finish you can just select this done option and then you can play it so this is how it looks like so you can make different kind of presentations different videos using this option once you finish just select the save option and then later you can share it with your friends or with your colleagues the next feature is about signing a PDF file so you can just open the PDF file for example I want this PDF file then select the Samsung notes PDF reader then I select just once now here is my PDF file so for example I want to sign over here now what you can do is just select this edit option and then you can select the pen that you want to use and here you can assign your PDF file so once you finish just select this save option and then later you you can share it the next feature is about magnify so you can use your s pen to magnify any text or any information for example i open this website and here i have this text which is very small so i can use the magnify option just select this air command and then select this magnify tool and now you can bring your pen closer to the text that you want to magnify for example i want to magnify this text so here you can see i can magnify it and now i can easily read it so here you can see and then if you want you can also uh, change the magnify percentage from here so if you just select it so here we have different options the next feature is about writing on calendar so you can open your calendar then you select this write option and then you can select any date that you want to write on for example I want to write on this date so I can use my S Pen to write if you want to write some important uh, reminder you can use it then here you can see there are different tools so you can select any tool from here different pens option different colors option you also have the eraser option if you want to erase once you finish you can just select this save option the next feature is about using your S Pen for AR Doodle. So I will open the AR command and then I select this AR Doodle. Now here you can use your S Pen if you want to highlight something in your video. For example, I have these objects. I will select start recording and then I will use my S Pen if I want to highlight something, if I want to write something and then once I finish, I will stop recording from here. So this will be really helpful if you want to specify any objects in your videos or you want to make some kind of demo videos so you can use your S Pen. The next feature is about S Pen customization. So you can go into the settings then you can go into the advanced features and then you can select this S Pen. So once you select it here are all the different S Pen settings. For example if you want to customize air actions just select this air actions option and here you have all different settings for air actions. If I just 
just go back and then here you can see we have air command air view s pen to text so different settings you can customize for your s pen so guys this is for today's video please like this video and please subscribe to my channel thank you very much